Hello and welcome to my video. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can make a YouTube background for your channel. So the first thing you need to do is come to sosguru.com, my website. Then when you're here, click on the downloads link at the top of my page. Then once you're here, you'll see the name of this video and there'll be a download link to the template for Photoshop. You will need Photoshop for this. Okay, once you've got that file downloaded, it'll save it to your desktop or wherever. Mine's there, so I'll double click on that. And there is the template that I've made for you. Now, you should have three layers, background, layer one, and layer two. I'll just take them all off so I can show you which is which layer. Layer two is where all your information from YouTube, so your videos and content of your page will be on. Layer 1 is the green one, and that's the background to those information layers. And then the background is the black layer. Okay, the first thing you're going to need to do is you need to go to Google Images or wherever and get a nice image that you like. So make sure that you get a large image so it'll fill a big screen if people are looking at your YouTube channel with a big screen. I've just typed in flow there and that's a good image for me so right click on it and click copy image. Then go back to Photoshop, make sure you click on the background layer and then press Control V and it should paste the layer above the background layer but underneath the other ones. So then you should be able to drag it around with the little arrow tool. If not, press the space bar and you should be able to. So I'm going to just put this up into the top left and then go to image and, sorry, edit and then free transform. Then you can drag it from the sides and corners and make it fill the whole template. position it how you want it then click on the little arrow tool and it'll say apply the transform and click apply okay the next thing you're going to do is layer one so click on double click on the layer and then click on gradient overlay and you can then take off color overlay then double click on the gradient and you can change the colors the right hand side is the top and the left hand side is the bottom. So remember this is the layer that's underneath your information, so, so the background to your video and things like that. <coughs> so choose a nice colour, one that flows with your background. So I'm going to choose a red like that and I'm going to keep my bottom as black so it'll flow with the YouTube page. So make sure that's on black and click OK. OK, and then OK again. There you can see, that's working quite nicely. Then layer 2, double click on that. Then go down to gradient overlay, put that on and take off colour overlay. Then double click on the gradient and choose some colours again that flow well with the background. You can actually, instead of choosing the colours manually, you can go onto the background with your cursor and then choose a the colour off the background. So you can get it a roundabout and then I'm just going to change it so it looks nice. Just change the colour slightly, click OK. Make sure the, the left hand side of that is black as well. So there, that's the basic colour colours sorted. Now the next thing I'm going to do is go back to layer 1 and I'm going to put a stroke on it and this will give it like a shine on the outside of it, outside of the layer, the outside edges, it will give it like a shine. The size I'm going to put 2 pixels, that works well. You can have, I'd say around 1 to 3 pixels works okay and there you can see it gives like a little edge to it. Then go to layer 2 and I'm going to do the same with this one. 